those damn dirty apes. <laughs> and aren't we all? Here's the Charlton Heston, folks. Charlton Heston. I uh, I was going through I guess Netflix or Disney or something, and uh, uh, I came across the old the original Planet of the Apes. It went 1968. I was eight years old for for God's sake, and uh, and and I was surprised and just out of curiosity, you know, I turned it on. And it's such a great movie, and uh, it starts out. There's a long section in the beginning where Charlton Heston and his two, uh, you know, astronaut companions uh, have crash landed on this strange planet. They don't know where they are, and it's like a desert, a desert landscape, and they're wandering through this desert for, you know, a good 15 minutes, a long time for a movie. And, um, and they're talking as they do it. And, and, uh, and, uh, they ask each other, you know, why did you go on this trip? And, uh, and, um, Charlton Heston says, you know, I just, I just couldn't believe that there wasn't somewhere out there in space, something better than human beings or mankind or something. And, and I thought, oh my God, that could be written today. That it's exa- That's Gen Z. You know, th- these are the guys. You know, they're 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 you know protesting. Uh, you know, Israel fighting against Palestine. You know, in in favor of uh, of of you know radical Islamic fascists um, against democracy, and uh, and 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 it's the same attitude. The same attitude today. Is everything is so terrible? We are the worst thing that could ever happen, and uh, especially America, but the Western world in general is so is awful. And 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 even then, in '68, though they had more reason to complain than we do, it wasn't true at all. I, you know, they had just gotten off their their fathers in '68. My father was in the Second World War fighting the Nazis. Look what the Nazis did. For, I mean. Did you see what they did? It was the worst of the worst of what man can do. You know, compare our time to uh, technologically in medicine, in 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 anything, but also like in in freedoms, in democracy, in in what the privileges we have today are are just so much different, so much better than any time at any place in world ever ever. And yet we persist in in thinking this is terrible. We're all this is terrible. I'm I'm growing up and mom and dad, but dad's a capitalist and and everything is is terrible. And I just don't get it. I don't see why. I don't understand why. Are we not teaching our children to look around at the world? Are we just blind? I don't understand it. You know, I look at this world and, and I see, I mean, there are plenty of things that, you know, go wrong and people are stupid. Uh, you know, I'm stupid. Why shouldn't everyone else be stupid? And you're going to make mistakes and, and, uh, and I'm worried of the future. But, but God, you know, this is a thousand times better living in the Middle Ages or even in, 19, in 1968. You know, Jim Crow laws were, went on up to 1965. Women couldn't open their own bank account. I mean, the, the world we're living in is so much better. Uh, I just don't understand. I, I cannot understand it. It's just weird. It just I look at it again and again, and I just surprise at how stupid people are. Every generation, we get stupid again. You know, we learn, we discover the world, we make the world better, and then we the next generation comes out plops out of us and and they're stupid well uh if i have uh, if i can put in my two cents worth for this world i'm proud and and joyful to live in this beautiful world that we live in with all its with all its confusion and its the fears that, that i have about uh, you know the future and what's going on and all the dangers that are there it's all true you know it's life is still dangerous and and life all could be better i'm i'm still glad i'm here and part of this world and uh, and i'm proud of what humankind has done in the last, you know, maybe 1,000, 2,000 years. Here's to humanity. Here's to humankind. Charlton Heston.
we're the best. We're among the best that the universe will ever bring forth. If there is ever a top 10, uh, you know, races, species in the universe, we would be maybe not number one, but we'd be in that top 10. Cheers and good night.